fashion lovers and welcome to another episode of Fashion TV. This week we'll be bringing you fashion tips and styles from the infamous King's Road. So stay tuned. I want to know what you're expecting tonight in terms of fashion and Chelsea. What's this show going to be about? Well, I'm very excited about the show because as people have the stereotype in their mind of Chelsea girls wearing twin set and pearls, I'm hoping tonight the fashion is going to be a bit more exciting, a sort of eclectic mix of maybe some vintage pieces and stuff that maybe is more affordable for people to buy. And walking down the King's Road on a normal day, what kind of celebrities would you expect to see in Chelsea? Well, actually, it's quite funny because a lot of celebs live just off the King's Road. So if you're on a shopping trip, you often bump into the sort of Hugh Grant, Liz Hurley, Kylie Minogue's got a place just up the road and also Christine and Frank Lampard. What is Anonymous Design Trademark? It's a lot of lace, it's kind of our speciality, really feminine, and we sort of specialise in knitwear and delicate pieces. And do you have any celebs that are really kind of loyal to your brand? One of our um, sort of, I suppose, most famous recent things is Kate Moss and her honeymoon wore some, one of our tunics, uh, again, our, our lace, a lace tunic on holiday. Is there a typical look that people ask, like a Chelsea look, when they come in? Well, the, the look at the moment is very modern. It's a very big hair, you know, the big sort of boho look, all the, the curls all falling down. So what's a boho look? The boho look is is um, a bit dishevelled, but big hair almost looks like you've just got out of bed, but your hair's dressed. Voted as one of the top ten boutiques in London in Vogue magazine, um, what do you think makes us look different? We stock brands that um, are very sort of up and coming, that other shops don't stock. And we offer also a very personal service. So, you know, our customers, when they come in, you know, most of them are regular customers. We know them and we really try to make a, you know, a huge effort to find something that really suits them and give them an honest opinion. There seems to be a number of young international designers coming through. What do you think makes the UK distinctive? It depends. I mean, I, th I think the trends obviously vary season on season, but I think the UK is very is a, a lot more open, in my opinion, yeah. to um, to kind of new fashions and new designers. I think it's always sort of there's always new people coming through. Whereas I think in I, d I mean I don't really know, but I think that's my view from you know seeing um, like Milan Fashion Week for yeah. example, you know, and I think that they're you know they're very, it's very much more sophisticated. Style, whereas England, whereas the UK is very sort of eclectic, you know, anything anything goes, and it's I think it's great. We've just seen the show, and I want to know what you thought of the fashion. Well, I thought the models were fabulous, but the fashion was also lovely, very Chelsea, very boutique-y, uh, very floaty, very elegant, what you'd expect uh, any good Chelsea girl to be wearing. Any favourite designers or brands? Well, I always love Austique. Um, it's a beautiful boutique that stocks some lovely, sort of unique collections, and there were some lovely sort of floaty maxi dresses on show tonight. And what about the crowd? As you're the showbiz queen, what did you think about the people there and kind of like the people invited to the show? Very Chelsea, darling. Very sort of lo lots of socialites, lots of movers and shakers in SW5. Thank you for joining us at Beaufort House for the King's Road Fashion Show. Hope you really enjoyed this evening full of fashion trends and tips and advice. Make sure you follow us on Facebook and Twitter for more fashion tips and tune in next week for more Fast Shot TV. Bye! Bye.